to my channel or if you're new here my name is Millie and I'm a calligrapher and designer as well as a small business owner. I've got a slightly different video for you today. It's not going to be about pens, it's not going to be about running a small business but it's a really important video and I'd absolutely love it if you could take the time to watch and also look at some of the links that I've shared below. So back on the last weekend in August I took on a challenge with three amazing friends and a dog. We decided to walk the whole of the Cotswold Way, which is 102 miles, and to do it in just five days. So averaging about 20 miles a day. Now, you're probably wondering why we decided to do that. And we've done it for a really important cause. We wanted to raise money for our incredible friend, Vicky. Back in October, 2020, our friend Vicky contracted sepsis after what was supposed to be a simple surgery. Unfortunately, this developed into sepsis shock. And due to the severity of the damage of this sepsis shock, she has developed life-threatening and very rare conditions. She is requiring a whole host of medication. It's also led to many unexpected surgeries. Now, in the UK, we do have the NHS, which can provide free medical care. However, due to the rarity of some of Vicky's conditions, it means that she's having to go through private health care. And so far, it has cost her thousands and thousands of pounds and it could potentially cost her thousands of pounds for the rest of her life. Her conditions are constantly changing and have been for over the past year. So what I'm going to do is leave a link in the description for her story. It's a just giving page, so if you wanted to donate directly to her, you can. We also have our sponsorship page from our 100 mile walk, which I'm going to leave in the description below as well. Now, although we took on this very difficult challenge, we knew that it would be worth it to help Vicky. And so far we've raised £6,300, which is just incredible. So massive thank you to everyone who has donated. We decided to film the whole walk just to give you a little taste of what we went through. But to be honest, looking back on it after editing, it doesn't really truly show some of the painful moments that we went through. There were a couple of times where we just were not in the mood and therefore we didn't necessarily film. But let me tell you, it was difficult. However, with high morale between us and the knowledge that what we were doing it was really going to help Vicky out, we just kept going and yeah, we did it. Spoiler alert. So in this video, I just wanted to share with you our journey over those five days. And you can also see Vicky welcoming us at the finish line and doing the last 100 meters herself, which was an incredible feat for her to do. And she had to stay in bed for a whole week beforehand just to make sure she had the energy to be able to be there with us. Thank you so much to everyone who supported us and I hope you enjoy this video. When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. <laughs> side by side our fears are done. All the good times just begun Oh, we know what we have, let's hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy, but things are finally right With you and I, the future is bright
100 miles for the last five days to raise money for my ongoing treatments um, and they're just about to come into the abbey and we're gonna join them and I can't wait to see them I miss them so so much and I can't believe what they've been doing for me so we wanted to capture this for everyone to see we are 52 pound away from 6,000 pounds and they have got 500 meters to go so if everyone could just spam the link spam this video see if we can get another 52 pound so that we can get the girls in on a nice round 6,000 that'd be lovely oh oh we see some girls oh, my God. oh 
the hair. We have Sophie and Jez and Saber and Millie and Millie. Yeah, yes. so much for watching this video if you'd like to donate to Vicky whether it's through our 100 mile challenge or straight to Vicky on her just giving all the money will be going directly towards her to help pay for urgent medical care I will leave links in the description below if you'd like to donate to either of those we also have an Instagram page where we are continually updating information about Vicky so if you'd like to keep up to date with what's going on and if anyone else is raising money for her then please follow the Instagram link below as well. I just want to say a huge thank you to everyone who has helped us along the way. So that is anyone who gave us lifts or picked up bags, everyone who was there at the finish line to cheer us on, and all the people who just generally gave us words of encouragement. And of course the dogs. I think the dogs really kept us going. So thank you so much for watching, and I hope this has given you a little bit of inspiration to do something good yourself and maybe help out a friend or a charity and do something amazing. I'll see you very soon. Bye.